So we've definitely got to find five different things to go in here. And I reckon... Oh, they reset. I was going to come back and maybe leave them down. See, I reckon that's one of them. I reckon that's the one... That you fill up the basin with. And we need a whale. It's not a whale. Where's the whale? That's not a whale. Is that a whale? No, it's got four legs. That's more like a seal. If it's a whaley bad pitcher or what? <laughs> it could be a whaley bad pitcher, couldn't it? <laughs> there isn't a whale here. That that's the closest thing to a whale, isn't it? So that's just a f some sort of fish. Do you think that's the birds we keep seeing? No idea what that is. I think that's probably the closest we've got to a whale. That one. Anna Marie, and thank you for the follow. I think we need a bird of some sort that goes chirp. Uh, we've got a scraping sound, which must be the scarab. So, is there a scarab here? That's the closest to a scarab, isn't it? You can help if you want part, yeah. I think we need a bumblebee or something flying off. Or a mosquito -y type thing. I need you to tell me which which aunt which <laughs> you think that would be the birdie? We need a bee or something. There's like no other insects here. Oh, what about this one? That's a. F Does that not look like a frog? It's only a picture of a bird. Because you're smart. Do you think it's. A yeah, it could be a crab, Mitchell. This is an insect, though. Problem is that's a bird as well, isn't it? No. That looks like a hummingbird. Or a bee. You think it could be a bee? Okay, they've all just risen up again because I forgot to put one down. <laughs> no. <laughs> we can only have five. Maybe make that the bee. This is the whale. We need the scarab. It's 
So that's one, two, three. We need the jellyfish. Which I've lost now. Oh. So we just need one more, which is the bird, I think. I think that's a jellyfish sort of thing. I'm just going by my dre dreadful drawing of what was the water. Looks like an anteater. Could be an anteater. What does that look like? <laughs> It could be an auntie, yeah. It's not a bird, it's a knife-winged seahorse bat. <laughs> yeah, there was there was another shape that looked like a jellyfish. Which is this one. That one. So I don't know. It, it could be either or, couldn't it? Let's put this one back up. And I don't know if we have to do them in the right order. I do have an order. So we've got we've got this. I think we just need the bird now or something, maybe or. But I don't know. We've got the scarab, we've got the whale, we've got a bird. Can we go back to, I don't know. I might have to mark these down again better. Trying to think where they were as well, that's the problem. We're also trying to open that, aren't we? I think maybe I should go back to each of the eyes and see if there is a proper animal at them, or and get a note, get a better thinking of the sound. Because we need them. Um... We know the whale is the fifth one. The whale is the fifth one. And I think the third one... Let, let, let me just work, get back to these things, because... They're all on this island anyway. There's one down in here. Uh, where the big dagger is. So there's a dagger here. 
I mean, what's, what sort of sound is that? Sounds like a donkey, doesn't it? Now that I hear it. So I've written the symbol down, so that's the that's for the number four. Could it be a donkey? There's usually a clue round about the, the how it looks. What is is that anything? It's not really giving me any any vibes of an animal, is it? Why have they got the torch lit up? The dagger lit up. I don't even know if there was a donkey there. I don't think it's the sound of a donkey. Could it be a seal? There's no sh nothing. You hear water as well, so it could be like a. S yeah, there's a bit of water there, isn't there? Could be a seal. There was a seal. I mean, that's how our seals sound like down on the beach. Yeah. Right, let's try and find the other one. My problem is finding them again, so... Um, I want to go... Yeah, I think... Let's conf... How do I get to the... It's this way. We've already that's definitely a whale. Right, down here is where... So here's the shape, look. See, I've got... I've got that... 
same this is the second one this is the deal Wait, so this is the second sound. I mean, is that the eye or is that the eye? If it's in the middle, it's more like the... There is one that's got the eye in the middle, isn't it? Like there. The, yeah, but I'm just going by... What sort of sign is that? Yeah, it's like a buzzing sound, isn't it? I had, I originally had Grumpy Bee flying off. That's, that's the sound. Could it be? Cut. <laughs> and then we've, we've got the... We've got this one. This is number three. It's like a chart pen, isn't it? But... I mean, there's, is there any shape? Yeah, it could be some sort of insect or something. There's no shape or anything that's... I can't remember where the the other the last eye was. But it was like a scraping noise. I think that's a scarab. Because we've had the scarab appear a few times here. Hmm. 
Is it off again? Is it? I maybe forgot to put it back on. No, it is on. Is it not working? Okay. So do we... It's maybe... It, sometimes it... Um, disconnects. It should be on just now. Uh, let me save. Okay, it's probably signed me out again as usual. Is it working? No. I think it had signed me out of the web page. Successfully authenticated. Now we should have captions. There we go, it's working again. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, that would be handy, Mitchell. Okay, part. Right, I'm not quite sure where the last eye was, but it, it, I'm pretty sure it's a scarab. So do we just play about with the shapes and see? You're also going to get food and coffee? Okay, no problems. Uh, we need to go with this. How do we get to there again? We need to go to the cell. Pity this wouldn't stay open. There's an animal and a number for each animal. Okay. Do you have to do them in the right order? Uh, probable. Yeah, I've got the numbers translated down, so I'm... The only one we're not really 100% sure of is, is this chirrup thing. Um... So we would have to do the scarver. Some people get to this point without the numbers, okay. <laughs> yeah, we had to work out the numbers for the, the spheres. I mean, we're presuming that's the scarab. And then we've got this... See, it could be that one, couldn't it? The pool shape. Yeah. We've been to all the spheres, apart from the tiniest island. The one square island. We've got the colours for the, the different islands. 
We know which shape is associated with which island. There's still the thing. We know we know which eye yeah, which eye colour is associated with which island. It's it's just very confusing at the moment. We've got two two shapes that could be this, couldn't we? Where was it? It's not that one then, is it? No, I think we can probably disregard that one. I think it's definitely the... This one. Yeah, we've been into all the spinning domes. Oh, there was one that I remember where we couldn't really see the book through it, and I don't think I've been back there. I have been, I've been going back to each of those spinning domes and we've opened them all up. We've got which colour or eye is associated with each one. We've got the code for them. We worked out the code. So that's the second, that's the pool shape. Now we need the birdie, or the insect. We had a seal, that was the seal. I reckon it's this, a seal for that one. Which one would be the the chirp type sound? Could be that. I mean, what is that? The last one's the whale. That didn't do anything. frog type thing. Why go back to...
I wonder if I need to light up like the green light under the under the was it that at the map world? Where was that? Where was that again? With the with the the little dials that we could change to see under the water. No, I didn't want to go there. I was just having a look around. Was that on the map world? I need to go over there, don't I, and then down. I can't remember if it was the Mark World or not. How did I get to the that room? How did I get to there again? You've never completed any one of them. Just tried Riven, but I didn't understand where to go. <laughs> I I enjoyed Mist. I did finish that. I finished that a few times, but um, I've never completed this one. Was it under there? It makes more sense if it's here. Let's just go back to Mark World. I really can't remember. <clears throat> yeah, I might have to switch. I'm going to switch zip option on. Can I zip over somewhere quicker? There. Oh, I needed to call the thing. Crap. Can I zip up to there now? Eh. I forgot I needed to call the... the train thing. <clears throat> I wish I'd written down where that room was. I can't remember where that room was. I just don't think it's here, but... I think it was through that other door. Let me turn this around.
Can I get my cursor back? Yeah. yeah, this was it. Right, okay. Um, this must do more than just show me which colour goes where. I wonder if we leave it on a specific one and then go to that book. Did I just... Oh, okay, I just zipped down there. <laughs> okay. I wondered what was going on. Let me go back down again. So I can zip down, can I? Okay. Zip. There we go. Right. We know that... We know one of them for definite. So if we go for the dot... We can switch that on. Does the light stay on? <clears throat> so if we if we now go back to Which island does this take us to again? <clears throat> this is the starting island. We're going to go back there and see if it's made any difference to the sphere. We're waiting on the train thing to come. I think I don't think the light will stay on. Luna back in. Hopefully she's not caught something else. Can I go just go check?
which island are we on here? <laughs> oh, okay. This is not the one I wanted, but it's it's quick enough to get back from here. Uh, where's the call button from here? I thought there was a button down. Oh, there. We're going to the sphere. I'm hoping maybe because we've lit that up, maybe energy goes to the sphere or something like that. So we can use it. Zip down to there now. It's a long way to go. Yeah, I'm just going to stream for another quarter an hour today I've got things to do it's my son's birthday tomorrow so I, I need to tidy the house up a bit right so we've got the code for here it's 24 20 5 3 2 nothing looks different here one of these was definitely opaque or something different looking Nothing looks different here, it's not lit up or anything. No, nothing different. So that wasn't worth doing. <laughs>
Hm, hm, hm. Danke, Jan. I I'm at a bit of a loss. I just thought that would like maybe energize something. We still have managed to get to the very small island. Um, which I can't see from here. I'm just wondering if there's another way out of here, but I don't think there is. To get to that small island. That island there. This is like a central hub that's let us get to everywhere so far. Can we work out the colour for the map island? Probably not. We did have the other colours though. I mean it could be it could be blue, yellow or orange. I've written down here frog sign from somewhere, but I'm not sure. Could that have been the chirp? But we did try that, didn't we? Pretty sure we tried the frog. <clears throat>
Hmm. This is where you get the scar. That's that's the, that's the shape for number one, and number one is the scar. So I mean, there could be a possible one, two, three, four, five, five exits out of here, couldn't there? I don't think we've done all five. There could be one. That's the num. It's 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 the number one, or it could depending on which angle we look at it. It could be the number five. If it's if you if the stroke is coming down the way, it's the number one. If it's going horizontally, it's the number five. But it's probably five because everything is five related. Actually. But we do have the fact that the five is the wheel. Which is why I think it's the scarb is number one. Logically, if there was a, a way to get to that island, it would have to be a door there. I would have to turn this... They're two apart though, so... There is another... There's that step there. Well, there's a button here, okay. One.
That's just the way out. That's just back to the cave where we can go under the gate. There's nothing back here, is there? No. So I think we've exhausted all the exits in the oven. We've exhausted everywhere there. Right, I'm not sure. <laughs> we shall save that there. Uh, I will stop there for today. I'm getting a bit tired. <laughs> I didn't sleep great last night, so I think I did not too bad, considering. <laughs> uh, I'm going to be back tomorrow morning. We're going to carry on with this. Um, I'll have a think about it overnight, look up, look through my notes I've taken, see if I can see any um, patterns anywhere um, in what I've written down. Um, let me see if I can find something to read and see who's on, unless anybody's got any suggestions. Um, Let me see if anybody else is playing um, the original Mist or something. Mist. Nobody's streaming Mist. Just dreadful. <laughs> Thank you, Anima. Um, right, I think we will raid on over to... Most of mine are playing JRPGs. Um, Haas is playing Battle Brothers. We'll read on over to Haas. Um, but yeah, I will be back tomorrow morning. Um, I'm hoping to be back on at my usual earlier time for a longer stream. Um, hopefully I sleep better tonight. Um, but there's my raid messages. Thank you all for being here. Uh, thank you for the support as usual and the follows. Uh, I will roll my credits very briefly and then I will raid on over. So until next time though, you all have a good rest of the day and take care. And I will say bye for now. <laughs>